Armored Personnel Carrier Armored Personnel Carrier is an armored fighting vehicle designed to transport infantry fighting troops on the battlefield, usually armed with a machine gun of less than 20 mm caliber, although variants may be armed with cannons, anti-tank guided missiles or mortars. This vehicle is not actually designed for direct combat, but is armed for self-defense and armored to protect the personnel inside from enemy attacks and explosive fragments. APC can use regular wheels or chain wheels. In this video the 10 best armored personnel carriers in the world. Number 1. AMV XP, Finland. The Patria AMV XP is a newer, improved and more capable version of the Patria AMV, which is currently one of the best armored personnel carriers in the world. XP stands for extra payload. Protection and performance. This armored vehicle was first revealed to the public in 2013. The Patria AMV XP was chosen by Slovakia. The Slovak military plans to order 81 of these armored vehicles for delivery between 2018 and 2024. Patria AMV XP has a maximum combat weight of 30 tons. It is heavier than the standard AMV, which is already one of the heaviest and most protected armored personnel carriers in the world. Considering the level of protection, the well-armed Patria AMV XP can be seen as a wheeled infantry combat vehicle. Not a wheeled armored personnel carrier. It is heavier, more protected, and has a heavier punch than most armored personnel carriers. In many ways it even outperformed many older IFVs, such as the American M2 Bradley, British Warrior, or Russian BMP-2. Number 2. AMV, Finland. The Patria AMV was developed in collaboration with the Finnish Defense Force. It was revealed in 2001. This APC had significant export success. Export operators are Croatia, Poland, and Slovenia. Several other countries also ordered this armored vehicle. With the maximum level of protection, the AMV's forward bow is resistant to 30mm armor-piercing bullets. The vehicle also has high-end mine protection. It is explosion-proof equivalent to 10 kilograms of TNT. Two Polish Army armored vehicles were hit in Afghanistan by RPG-7 rockets. But the armor was not penetrated and the vehicles managed to return to base. The basic version is armed with a remotely controlled 12.7mm machine gun, or a 40mm automatic grenade launcher. This APC is equipped with a powerful engine, producing 490 or 540 horsepower. The base variant is completely amphibious. Number 3. Piranha V, Switzerland. In service with Monaco. The vehicle has an all-welded armored hull with integrated add-on composite modular armor. The vehicle has a double floor with a V-shaped hull and is well protected against landmines and IED blasts. This APC is also available with an active protection system. In the APC configuration the vehicle is proposed with a 12.7mm heavy machine gun or a 40mm automatic grenade launcher. A well-armed and well-armed Piranha V can even be considered a wheeled infantry fighting vehicle. Piranha V is equipped with a powerful engine, producing 580 horsepower. Number 4. LAV 6.0, Canada. The upgrade is based on lessons learned by the Canadian Army during combat operations. General Dynamics Land Systems was awarded a contract to upgrade 616 Canadian Army LAV-3 vehicles to new standards. It is planned that all of these vehicles will be upgraded through 2017. These will form the backbone of Canada's armored vehicle fleet. Saudi Arabia ordered a total of 900 LAV-6.0 armored vehicles in various versions. The upgraded LAV 6.0 weighs significantly more than the original LAV-3. A fully upgraded vehicle with an additional protective kit weighs just over 28 tons. Protection has been improved, although many of the core design elements remain the same. It is currently one of the most protected armored personnel carriers in the world. The most notable difference from the upgraded LAV 6.0 is the dual V-shaped hull. 
It seems that with this kit the maximum overall level of protection against 14.5mm armor piercing rounds in the front bow resists attacks from the 30mm cannon. The Canadian Army base vehicle has a two-man turret, armed with a 25mm M242 Bushmaster chain gun. Saudi Arabia ordered the LAV 6.0 armored personnel carrier armed with 20 and 30mm cannons. LAV 6.0 has improved the fire control system with an integrated target detection. Recognition and identification system. The view of the tower has been improved. So the overall vehicle surveillance capability increases. This armored vehicle is powered by a 450 horsepower Caterpillar diesel engine. Number 5. Aton, Israel. Aton is the new Israeli APC. An Aton prototype was first revealed to the public in 2016. It will enter service with the IDF in 2021. The Aton has a layout typical for a modern APC. It weighs about 30 to 35 T and is well protected. In terms of mine protection the vehicle is most likely designed to withstand an explosion equivalent to 10 kilograms of TNT. The Aton will be equipped with the Advanced Iron Fist Active Protection System. The Aton prototype is equipped with a remotely controlled weapons station. Armed with a 12.7mm machine gun. Other weapons, such as a 30mm or 40mm automatic cannon, will also be available on the production version of the Aton. At least part of the IDF's Aton will be equipped with unmanned turrets. Number 6. M1296 Dragoon, USA. Its official designation is Infantry Carrier Vehicle Dragoon, or ICVD. It is said that the Striker Series vehicles are superior to other armored personnel carriers in terms of survivability against mines and improvised explosive devices. Recently an explosive reactive protective kit was designed for this vehicle. It can effectively attack light armored vehicles up to a distance of 3,000 meters. This round is also effective against unmanned aerial vehicles. It connects with other similarly equipped vehicles and command posts. It displays friendly vehicle position information. Each brigade has more than 300 strikers of all variants, including APCs, reconnaissance vehicles, 105mm fire support vehicles, 120mm mortar carriers, command vehicles, armored engine vehicles, ambulances, anti-tank missile carriers and NBC reconnaissance vehicles. Number 7. Ares, United Kingdom. Ares is Britain's new armored vehicle. This is not an ordinary infantry parts carrier, but a specialist team carrier. This new armored vehicle is technologically advanced. The Ares vehicle weighs about 30 tons. So the Ares level of protection should be similar to that of a well-protected infantry fighting vehicle. Unfortunately Ares was never designed to combat enemy armored vehicles and lacks anti-armor capabilities. Most of the other armored vehicles on this list are capable of carrying cannons and even anti-tank missiles. Number 8. M1283, United States. The M1283 is the U.S. Army's newest armored personnel carrier. It was adopted following the armored multi-purpose vehicle program to replace the venerable M113A3 armored personnel carrier. The vehicle has a welded aluminum armored hull. The front bow has aluminum and steel-coated armor. It is estimated that the forward bow provides protection against 30mm armor-piercing rounds and overall protection against 14.5mm armor-piercing rounds. The vehicle has a V-shaped hull floor. Also the hull floor is reinforced with armor plates for a higher level of protection against landmines and IED explosions. There is an ongoing trend to reduce the number of troops carried by armored vehicles. Although most other modern APCs are equipped with remotely controlled weapon stations operated from within the armored hull. These armored vehicles are superior to wheeled vehicles in terms of off-road mobility. With some preparation, this armored vehicle is amphibious. It is planned that during the initial phase more than 2,900 of these armored vehicles will be delivered to the U.S. Army to replace the M113 and its variants.
Number 9. Turex, Singapore. The Singapore Turex is one of the newest and most advanced armored personnel carriers. It entered service with the Singapore Armed Forces in 2006. The maximum level of all-round protection is against 14.5mm armor-piercing bullets. The vehicle has a double V-shaped hull, which diverts mine blasts away from the vehicle. The Turex can withstand a TNT blast of up to 12 kilograms under the hull and the vehicle is still moving. The basic version is armed with a remote-controlled 40mm automatic grenade launcher and a 7.62mm coaxial machine gun. Or it can be equipped with a remotely controlled 12.7mm machine gun. Turex is equipped with a powerful engine, developing 400 horsepower. This armored personnel carrier is highly mobile due to its powerful engine and advanced independent suspension system. These APCs are amphibious. Number 10. Boxer, Germany slash Netherlands. It is a completely modular vehicle with interchangeable snap and modules. It uses a single chassis for different purposes, including infantry carriers, command vehicles, ambulances, supply carriers, and so on. Damaged protective plates can be easily replaced in field conditions. Also this APC has a low radar and acoustic signature, making it harder to detect. While well protected, the standard boxer is armed only with a remotely controlled 12.7mm machine gun, or a 40mm automatic grenade launcher. There are several versions proposed with a turret-mounted cannon. And that's the 10 best armored personnel carriers in the world in our opinion, don't forget to follow our channel like, comment and subscribe. Thank you for watching.